Mike Masters Media here with the one, the only, mm. Big K. That's right. The dog strikes again. Yeah, absolutely he does. So this evening, man, Massacre 6, two big moments. Before we get into any of that, what are your what are your thoughts right now? How are you feeling? I mean, that's the thing about the dog. He strikes again, you know? And I just feel like I struck again, you know? Even in a room full of, the deck was stacked against me a little bit. I was a little bit outnumbered. I had to pull out the veteran tricks, you know what I mean? But I had to show them, like, you know, I'm one of the best that ever did this year, ever. Not right now, ever. When the lights go out, one of the best that ever did this shit. You're going to respect it. I don't care if I'm 20 deep, if I'm by myself, if I'm behind enemy lines, if everybody in the building want to see me, you're going to respect this shit. I promise you. I saw a moment, we all saw a moment there. Uh, you and Jeruz. Yeah. What happened? He thought I was like trying to grab Tay Rock when I was doing like this, but I was trying to get Tay Rock attention. I think he was looking somewhere else. I was trying to, it was never about to go there, but he thought it was about to go there. So it kind of made it look like it was going to go there. But it never, on my end, it was never going to go there. I ain't never feel like, oh shit, this is past battle. I'm just glad it got, it didn't ruin the battle because you only get one shot to get these things right. And like 95% of these big grudge matches, they don't live up to the hype. You know? And then this to be a grudge match since 09, and go down in 2024 and still live up to the hype. That's the thing about the dog, he strikes again. If you want this type of shit to happen, you gotta come see him. You can't get this from these other guys because they're not fucking capable of it. That's why I be whooping up on them. You wanna go to the promised land, come see me, man. Let's go. There is uh, talk online chatter, as it were, about about Tay Rock obviously being in a in a place where he was gonna potentially clear and da 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 this that and the third champion of the year run for him as he's going through yo back to back potential champion of the year runs for you right now was there any point during this preparation that you took that a little bit to heart? Yeah, only because when I won. You know, he, he downplayed my accomplishment. And it's like, even though me and Tay Rock had all this shit going on, like, I don't, I don't, it's, it's very few, like, tangible things you could get out of Battle Rap. Like, you can't get no trophy, there's a belt. So this is like memorabilia for like, that belt, whoever wins it, the people that have it, you'll have it for the rest of your life. So 20, 30 years from now, God willing, you stay alive, you can look at this, you know what I'm saying? So it's not even about, you know, it's just a little, you know, it's something. So when people are disrespectful when I want it, and then I gotta battle you, you gotta feel this, pause, you know what I'm saying? But you're gonna have to, you're gonna understand when you were saying, oh, you don't deserve this, let me show you why I do. You want this belt, let me spank that ass with it. No pause. Spank your raw ass with it, you know what I'm saying? With King of the Dot, Takeover Battle League, they took it upon themselves. Shout out to Chilla Jones, Organic, Gully, the whole team. Mm -hmm. They took it upon themselves, ruined your day, Avocado, to create in August up to at least this year, the event of the year. Absolutely. Speak, yeah, speak on, speak on the two days real quick for us. Give us, just give us a recap of the feeling, the, the, yeah, the momentum, the energy. Give them what they want first. Yeah, we'll give them what they want first. We do this shit right Whoa, 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 Hold up, K. Hold up, K. You know what I mean? Hold up, K. We're gonna do that shit the right way, man. Hold up. That shit for the dog himself, man. The dog strikes again. You see all of this shit, man. Shout out to Jay Black. Champion, shake my hand. You know what I'm saying? This is what they want. They'll never fucking smell it. They'll never fucking smell it. You know what I'm saying? This all good. Yeah, man, what were we talking about? <laughs> it's all good. Yeah, it's all good. Uh, we're talking about King of the Dot Takeover Battle League. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. How yeah. were the two-day? Um, the first day. Mike was, Masters, shit, we helped. We should, yeah, we were, for sure. Yeah. Everybody's in Boston. Yeah. Effort, man. Teamwork make the dream work. We know that. But, uh, yeah, two days of phenomenal battle rap. Every battle, to me. And I pretty much seen all of them. Well, not today. I, I showed up a little late because I had to battle. You know how that goes. Yep. But everything I seen in the building was insane. And I seen all the battles yesterday. There's a, uh, obviously we're all here at the hotel. So like, does that like that air 
EK was talking about it yesterday, or Friday, excuse me, about how um, sometimes this feels like an AAU circuit. Uh, do you ever get that feeling? Or like camaraderie? That's right. Yeah, like even with somebody like Tay Rock. You see how we bought it into the joint? He was like, bro, I love you. I said, I love you too. People probably think we hate each other, but it's like, and we did. Absolutely. But it's it's, it's competitive, man. Y'all make it real. You guys put who you, who you, the battle rapper you love in your your bio, a line that they say as your username and shit. Like, you take it, you willing to die on some shit that you don't even know what the fuck is going on. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying this shit is wrestling, but it's some camaraderie in this shit. And at, me and Tay Rock been at it since 2009. So you mean to tell me, like, a person, whether we like it or not, we've been in each other lives since 2009. You see what I'm saying? Even if we hate each other. So, uh, I mean, I'm not a monster, bro. You know what I'm saying? It don't, why would it take for something bad to happen for people to acknowledge it? And that's usually what happens in battle. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, well, okay, really quick. Off that point, um, and I'll, I, I have this question, and then we'll end it with uh, you being out in Salt Lake. Um, but you seem to take every battle, no matter what the A, you know, no matter what we just spoke about, you seem to throw that out. Lead up to the battle, to the battle, and then we're good. That's a very unique trait. Yeah. Do you think that that would be better served in battle rap to happen more often, even if you guys have camaraderie? Yeah, because like what, what's happening is like it's a new wave of battlers coming in. You know what I'm saying? People we've been watching, we've been watching for ten years or plus. You know what I'm saying? And it's like it's unfortunate that, in my opinion, the people you've been watching for this long, we still do it the best. That's why when like new dudes come in, they tend to have like a disrespect towards vets. They're like, oh, we don't need y'all. Get out the way. We could do this if y'all don't want to be here. It's all good. But literally, if all of us just stop, bro, this shit will die. Y'all don't have it yet, and it just is what it is. When you got it, you got it. You know what I'm saying? Some people it's good, but if all of us just decide, yo, we not battling no more, y'all can't carry this shit. Why do? It, why can't y'all acknowledge that? It's weird. It's weird to me, you know what I'm saying? Like when I came into this shit, you could ask any of the greats. I battled them all, but before I battled them, I gave them respect. I show, I made sure I put them to the side and was like, I fuck with you, you know what I'm saying? You, if, if it was somebody I really respect, you could ask all of the greats. I done battled damn near all of them, you know what I mean? It's a way to pay homage and still say, I fuck with you, you great at what you do, you just can't beat me. You know what I'm saying? And you gotta respect that, it, that's a lost art in this shit. A lost art that a battle rap too is like, creating hype for a matchup without just being disrespectful. Mm. Like, if you come in and I don't know you from a can of paint, you just like, man, fuck Big K, he a pussy, and I three on I'll never battle you now. You know what I'm saying? Like, eat shit. You know what I'm saying? Starve. You know what I'm saying? As a matter of fact. Because I didn't even know you, and you came in picking a side on a stranger. You could have easily said, man, Big K is whatever, you just can't beat me in the battle. But they don't know how to do this no more. So, it's like, you know. I see that. Okay. Okay. Salt Lake City. Mm. I love. I can't wait to go there. We gotta bring you out. Yeah. Outside of hosting, who do you want to see out on a neutral ground in Utah, bro? Ooh. Like by name? Damn, that's 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 deep. Oh, by name? Mm. I say this. It's five names that the people want right now. And wherever they happen at is wherever they happen at. You know what I'm saying? If it makes sense, it makes sense. I'll give you the five names that the people want. They want Big K versus A. They want Big K versus Filth Collector, AKA Filthy Bill. They want Big K versus Goods. They want Big K versus Easy to Block Cat. And they definitely want Big K versus New Jersey Twerk. Any one of those, I'll be more than willing to go. We're gonna see you in Salt inch Lake. Of the earth. Yeah, we're gonna and see. It happens you. if we have, but if I come to Salt Lake, we battling on Salt Lakes. We're not battling inside nowhere. We're gonna battle on the Salt Lakes. We'll go to the Salt Flats. Yeah, we'll go to the Salt Flats and shoot an outside location battle. I like that. I Insane. like that. I like that. All right, Mike Masters Media. Any other shout outs you want to give real quick before we get out of here? Shout out to Mike Masters. Shout out to King of the Dot. Shout out to TVL. Shout out to Organic. Shout out to my man Kenny Black. Shout out to Chilla Jones. Shout out to everybody that had anything to do with putting this shit together, man. Master Six, that's the thing about the dog. He strikes again. And I'm a master of the mic. Pause.